MovieWeb.com. Okay, well, the first question I got to ask is the thing I was most amazed at it, after watching the trailers. This is not spoofy at all. Oh, no. No, it's it just deadly, is deadly one. serious. Yeah, this is a deadly serious to the death ping pong film. movie. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, our inspiration for the film was not from, like... Crazy sports movies. Crazy, yeah, it's, was, it's from, like... Drunken Master Two, and you know, like like real kung fu movies. And like, what's great in Jackie Chan movies, even the like funny Jackie Chan movies, when it turns to martial arts, they get deadly, deadly serious. And in this one, it goes to ping pong. Ping pong instead. So it, it like it, this is very influenced by the Once Upon a Time in China's uh, that we grew up with. Well, a lot of people hear ping pong and they think, oh, that's that's a funny sport. But then once you start watching it, you see how intense this gets. It's really, really intense. If you haven't watched a tournament lately, it's not it's not like people going. I mean, they're back. You know, they'll be back 15, 20, 30 feet from the table. The ball goes, you know, really high. The spin is incredible. It's it's. They take it very seriously. But they're still wearing little tiny but shorts. Tiny and they're not in that great And you shape. can kind of see yeah. their balls. And you can kind of play while eating a donut. Yes, you can. Of. You totally can. Which you can't play that in most yeah. sports. But yeah. you can kind of still win and have a cup of coffee and not spill it. Yeah. Well, one of the things I wanted to ask you guys is there's not a lot of CG in this either with the balls, right? Mm. Most of that's None. real. None. 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 It's amazing that I could sit here and tell you that there's no CGI in this movie. No trick photography. It's amazing that I can tell you that. But I wouldn't say it if it weren't true. One take, most of the... Well, you can tell it's not true in the movie. I mean, you know it's real watching it. Right. Exactly. Now, did you guys actually see a real off-table game when you were going to these underground ping-pong clubs? The ping-pong clubs that we went to, um, usually what they are is in the evening, they're a, a ping-pong uh, school, and during the daytime, there's like a whole bunch of eight-year-old girls doing gymnastics <laughs> with ribbons on sticks, and then, you know, at around 6 p.m., they kick the little girls out and they start... And it gets it gets hardcore. Yeah. And it did never really gets that hardcore. It's they they put a bunch of ping pong tables out. Our 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 trainers did a game uh, like because they read it in the script that we play ping pong like on the floor and stuff. And so like we have a Wei Wang who's like an Olympic bronze, and they did a off the table like floor wall. Oh, match. they can do anything. And yeah. it was incredible to watch. They can it put the great. ball anywhere. Oh, it works. Yeah. It works. They well, they were surprised. The little girls that do the I don't know what that's called the ribbon Ribbons dancing. On sticks? Yeah. Uh, now is that where you found the dragon at? Uh, we just auditioned and she came in. She's fantastic. She's a genius, Lana yeah. Shi, yeah. Lana she, she's just a, a, a brilliant, scary little girl. And we, we, <laughs> yeah. she's made. We, she's become a regular on Reno 911. Yeah. Uh, Whenever the, we needed someone who's going to come in and scare the crap out of we us, we brought in her it's, this it's last her. season. Just yeah. she's fantastic. Yeah. And she's a real player, though, right? She actually does play. Yeah. 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 yeah she can play. There's an homage to Big Trouble in Little China in this. Was that intentional? The makeup kiss scene. Well, I think anything you do with James Hong is going to be very a much bit like that. filled yeah. with that cuz he'll just start quoting it. You know, like like he'll yeah. he'll he'll start doing his his The first time we thing. met him, he uh he uh he brought in huge autographed pictures for us with uh in in the in the outfit yeah. which we did not ask for. Did Here. you see the shirts with the that he made himself that he was selling at the Comic-Con? <sighs> no. Oh, they're awesome. <laughs> what, he was selling shirts at the Comic Con. Yeah. Okay. So how I much were they? Out. What did they say? Twenty was, bucks. Was it doing the thing? No, it was from uh, Blade Runner. Yep. And it, it said something about I only do eyes. I only do yep. eyes. Yeah. Twenty bucks. Mm -hmm. Did you get one? I was going to, but I went back and he was gone. We wrote this for him. Like, like we wrote when we wrote Master Wong. Like in our heads, it was the cadence of of James Hong, and we the whole time we were doing it, we were like. Who can we find that can do like that as good as James Hong does it? And then and it turned out James Hong was like two blocks away from me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm a big, big trouble fan. It's a, it's great to work with him. It's he's a very interesting bird. 